spaces all ready to go. I just made about 40 of them. You know, about 40. Or whatever, however many you come up with. I just make more than I need. And in my in my bone pile here, I've got a bunch of scraps from when I was making my knife. Some broke, some didn't. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and pipe these on here. In order to pipe these, you have to use some care because to get a really good, like, nipple of Venus going, the way to do it is you've got to hold your piping to a good half an inch up off the surface. And you're going to pipe straight up and down. And you're going to pipe about, a, say, about a half an inch above, create sort of a round sphere, and then stop squeezing and pull away. And you're going to get a nice, even peak. I'm looking to make my piece about the same diameter and same as, as big around as my as my bases. Because if the bases are bigger than the than the top, what's gonna happen is it's gonna show when I cover them with chocolate. So I'm just gonna go ahead and pipe these out here. These bases are also gonna make absolutely sure that I don't have any bald spot on the bottom because it's a solid uh, tempered chocolate. Uh oh. Bit of a doopy doo there. So remember, you have to stop squeezing in order to get it to get it to a nice clean peak. Otherwise, if you don't stop squeezing, it'll just keep coming out. Now, after I pipe all these, I'm going to refrigerate them, get them good and cold before I dip them in my chocolate. And we'll do a dipping thing here in a little bit. Like anything else, of course, I'm trying to make my portions about the same size. Now you can see I just hit a lump. That was a lump that we just saw there. How much of the edging of the base do you want to see? Not much. I try to make it about the same size as the base. Um, so the base is almost invisible. You know, I'm really trying to take it, I'm not trying to draw attention to the base. That's how I'm your butt. Yes, may I borrow your spatula? Sure. In the book, it shows the lighter. Is it because they use different kinds of chocolate? I think it's milk chocolate that they use there. Yeah. You can actually use white chocolate with this. You can use milk. You can use dark chocolate. We're just using dark chocolate today. Uh, you'll find that dark chocolate is a lot easier to temper and a lot easier to work with than white or milk chocolate. And the reason why is because there's more cocoa butter in it.